We're going to be doing some taste testing of the Asian style beef strips with vegetable and sauce flavored with oyster flavored oyster sauce. Uh, this is a new product. Uh, we're all kind of excited to see what this is all about. We got some water heated up here and we're just going to drop them in. So we've had the Asian beef strips in here about seven to eight minutes and we're going to go ahead and pull these out, break them open, get on the plates and we'll come back to you and let us, let you know what our opinions are. I think that's kind Ooh, of Ooh, that yeah. looks awesome, doesn't it? This is so good. Ooh, and I know this is that. exactly like the beef teriyaki that we used to have years and years ago. And I looked up, just in case, I looked up uh, what we used to sell the beef teriyaki for because it was so long ago. And back then we sold it for $1.75. So that tells you how long it's been since we've actually had something like this. This is really, really good. It is good. That's nice. Um, nice chunks of meat in there. The sauce is good. Um, I can't say I really taste any kind of oyster flavor, but if it's in there, then it's helping the, the dish. So I like it. Very good. I'm going to eat the rest of this now. <laughs> oh, let me walk that car. This is very good. The beef tastes kind of similar to that uh, tray pack of beef roast. Yeah. Or wherever that was in yeah. a super way. Yeah, but it doesn't have that, you know, that MRE metallic mm -hmm. flavor. I don't taste that at all in here. That's nice. Probably the one of the best MREs I've had so far. And I've had a decent amount too. And I like the chick tomato feta, but I'd say this is probably better. Visually stunning. You got a nice array of brown with some water chestnuts, the green and the red peppers. It's a visual treat. Now we'll see if it's as nice to the palate as it is to the eyes. How'd you like that one, huh? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Jen's on a diet, so she can't eat the whole thing today. I've lost 42 pounds, thank you very much. Yay, Jen. I like that. One of the better MREs I've had. This flavor. The meat isn't stringy. I thought it'd be kind of stringy. And a lot of times with the MRE meat, you get that, I don't know what else to call it, but the MRE flavor. And it just, it's comparable to a tray pack where you have, actually tastes like meat and tastes like what it says on the outside of the box. I like it. Yeah. Yeah. Two thumbs up with my broken fork. I give it an A. Thumbs up. <laughs> oh boy, this is one of my favorites. Awesome. Excellent. It is. Yeah. I want some biscuits on this or something. Just dip. Yeah, you know, we could use a little bit of rice, Great. couldn't we? Very nice. Next time. Right. Next time. Well. What do you think about the oyster sauce flavoring? Isn't that just like any Chinese food you've had? Yeah. With the, that um, kind of flavor? It's not real strong, you know. Um, just overall, it just has great flavor, great seasoning. It just. It's just really nice. It's, it's good. I'm not an expert on water chestnuts, but they taste like water chestnuts. Crunchy, not soft at all. Mm -hmm. This also has bamboo shoots in it, which uh, I really like the texture of. Mm -hmm. All in all, this one's awesome. This is a good one. I, I actually really like this one. I think uh, since I am dieting, I think the calorie and fat content is very, very comparable to a... I think it's actually probably less than a... Big Mac. So, <laughs> you know, I, thumbs up. This is definitely something I would want to lick the plate clean with. You're almost there. I'm getting there. <laughs> we really have licked our plates clean. <laughs> Show your plates, people. Show those plates. Goodbye. Look at that plate. <laughs> oh, boy, that's good. We like that. My plate's over there. Wait, yours still has some stuff on it. Not really. Taste it later.